So this is a cataract with grade 2 nuclear sclerosis and our plan is to use pre-chopper in this case. This is the main incision with a 2.8 millimeter steel keratom. And this is phenocaine which contains gyalocaine, tropicamide and phenylephrine. And here goes ASPMC, 2% hydroxypropyl methyl cellulose. It is applied over the cornea for better visibility. And now from the main incision, about 90 degree away, I'm going to do a side board. And now capsular axis with the uterator forceps. The center part of the capsule is pierced. Go to periphery, hold on site, and do with the axis. Guide the tag all around and do a axis of about 5.25 millimeter. And now hydrodissection, 27 Gauss cannula in BSS, see the fluid wave as it goes to the other side, hydrodissection is complete. Interchamber is filled up with visco. Now this is the pre-chopper and this is the nucleus sustainer. The nucleus sustainer goes, supports the eye. The pre-chopper goes and it engages just in front of the main wound. The sustainer hooks the opposite equator and the nucleus is divided into two hemineucleus. Rotate. The interchamber has become shallow. We can inject some visco, pre-chopper aragwada. And now we can use the pre chopper again to divide this nucleus. We have got three pieces and one hemineucleus is partially cracked. Here goes the hand piece, it is Faro's from Oatly. So this three piece is sealed and it is emulsified. The job is almost 70% done. You just have to hold the pieces and emulsify. This piece is not fully cracked, just hold it here and divide it like this. Turn the hand piece, make the bevel up. Eyeball should always be in primary position. Echo 2, now the vacuum is 400. Now in the handpiece itself, we will remove the cortex. Yes. So it is done. Irrigation done. Now we will do hydro implantation of the intraocular lens. Little, some fibers are there, you can remove it after implanting the lens. Lens to the... This is a B cartridge, we are going to enlarge the main wound just by one cut. Here goes the intraocular lens. 
and the lens goes in the capsular bag. Turn. Aspiration to ready to go. Some fibers are there. We will remove those fibers now. Place the eye well and remove some cells or fibers or whatever is there. See the axis has overlapped the optic all around. And the case is done. The side port is closed by corneal stromal hydration. And this is the final lavage of the interior chamber. The interior chamber is nicely formed. The integrity of the wounds are checked. Oxy and the case is concluded. Thank you very much.